This news is sponsored by Tap Tap Sen. Oh. Yeah, my people are on a day. Another day, don't shake it for another strong mock news. Now, me that they call Piri Panapanti. I put down your contact. We're gonna go to the king of mock news. According to my ancestors, they say somebody don't the old, they go they sit down, they bath. You know, go they hurry. Uh, with my level of my kinship, I'm not sure so I need to be shot. Why am I just saying no, king don't shot? When you are born with royal blood, you will understand where I'm coming from. <laughs> okay, there. <laughs> okay, there. So, today, mock news. I'm an officer, I'm going shot. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not a king. Uh -huh. Some of them are not seeing me for the. King Shah's coronation because I just say make I keep on coded, but I was there. Among all the king for Nigeria now, only me now they take. Make they cut cut long story short, more go straight to the reason why we are here. And this is all that they say for around when I rub a guy, even myself I don't know which are the way again because even me now I shock. The king for my area says see because he says shoo. Bless him, we can't borrow clothes from my ass and not try that, not try that. So my people go go hey as I know shot. So my people will go straight to the reason why we are here in no time. No, this king, this king character will not feel work. <laughs> we'll go straight to the <laughs> Yeah, my people, how are they? <laughs> this year, we're going to bring on a better confirmed news as we they always do. Where they very educative, exciting and informative. And it is verified on our platform. So make sure that don't forget to press the subscribe button, like and share so that you now will get our update all the time. We will bring on a correct update on health, politics, religion, and interviews when go make Africa a better place for all of us to stay. When I go to see comedy skits with news, we go keep our fans they excited. So make una no fail to always stay giddy by on our platform, Prara Mock News. We there everywhere to give una better updates. Keep watching and subscribing to Parara Mock News. What do you want to do? Oh yeah, subscribe to my YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and then even TikTok and then. Oh, yeah, we're all a Sunday. If you know, say you be pastor for Africa, or you the wait, may God call you, or you see they go pastor school to become pastor, or you want give God miss call, or you want flash God, or God no one call you, you call yourself. <laughs> Bra. <laughs> but they can fast. May you can see what this pastor do. I day on my own, you're the screw, they look for news, you know me now. Nah? As a king of mock news, I mortalize anybody. I know even they care who you be. I know say some of them are they wait for the day of my downfall. Oh, <laughs> yeah, in a carry. Now they are see what this man do. If I know what this man do, I will shock the lies. When I see this very boy, when I see so, they be like three years before. They be stay bush. Hunger don't wire them. If you push up yourself, cause they fear to catch them. When you am the big queen, man, you man a kill you, kill zombie. When I don't watch Apocalypto, Apocalypto people they stay bush for that movie. They even get blood pass and they even they enjoy pass these children. Hungry don't be the children. So tell the children cause they speak Chinese. In English, in Kwan Kwan, because of hunger. You will see the kind of food where they eat. Even me, King Parara, I was. I, I shed tears. Waking, not supposed to shed tears. I shed tears. I say, wow. Now there they call the pastor. He said, bring that to me. Now there the pastor feel. Under three months. Okay, hunger is a bastard, though. Some of the people with their day shots, where they say, ooh, now nah, hungry, now nah, and I mean, they say, now nah, devil, they beat them. Those of them never watch the people where they take day bush. <laughs> where they be like, Mashoko. <laughs> oh, yeah. Regardi <laughs>
Women are not see them after the pastor don't fertilize them. Oh, yeah, Regardilla. Come on, now. We see what the pastor they do. Some of all these pastors now are to treat people, bring, give God, shaktalize God, optimize God, provoke God. How can you provoke God? Do to God or call the scripture for you. Not only Nigeria Christians, some of them, not only them. If you not give for us of God, God cannot bless you. Ah, God, they always they ask they say, now only people they give, now not they give people. See what the pastor do. Some of them are get money pass this pastor for this country. But no. All the ones when I even saw now they give said, I see people see they, they contribute. Healing school. Healing like this. Healing like this. Nigeria pastor, Muna, Muna, Opua, I can't. Muna start to help people. The money we na get is too much. One of the pastor, one of the big church for this country now, he doesn't want to sack people because no money. He knows he sack that time. I talk about that now. He use brain. Ted one. I just they look all over now for this country. Help. To help people had a lot of pastor. But they would tell you, say, help, give, 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 give. But I know not carry all this nonsense called my palace. <laughs> okay, then. They don't even know the king. Nice one, uh, OPM. Dr. Jesus in action. OPM. OPM. Dr. Jesus in action. You understand? One news come, but I know verify her. Had they come for the other one, no time. We'll go straight to the other news. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people for this world think, say, all their problems are spiritual, especially the society where they born us to, to commit. Every small pin, we don't say not spiritual. Any small addict, we don't say not spiritual because of the problem, the way the society where they bring us to, to enter. Any small thing, not God. Any small thing, not devil. Any so, so the thing, not they affect us. Some of us now know the difference between physical problem. A spiritual problem again because everywhere for Nigeria they fight problem of spiritual. Now be the problem with this. When I see these very people where they so I bled their face so that many their family not love them. They don't they look for children for the past how many years. So people say a spiritual problem say they tie their womb tie like this. 
Now me go read more news about Oyema Empire. The woman, if they look for Peking, if he look you like this with one eye, he get herbs. Where you support to the dream because some of them are never born, not be person town and wumbo. Now, so kind, dirty, so kind, physical problem on again. I did there. Now, I tied the womb. When I was, oh, now my, if anybody you're hung, ugly like this, is that your family? Say, nah, eh, now they suspect, now they shot my children. Some of them now, not be spiritual problem on again, get, now physical problem. Cause see, what I read for more, because if I did read here, you know, not good listing. Now, dead the woman, they take, go write. Oh, yeah. Now they tell you send the medicine, they call it treat. Them. Because all of them, when I do need miracle, I make some of them see they like this, so, because when I define automatic, automatic, and they touch you now, now you get below. <laughs> My brother, life now process. Because see now, people don't be born now with this woman treatment. Not be juju, not be anything. Normal, physical, something with give you drink organic to treat your womb, treat yourself, to flush talize things. Those of you know about your miracle, <laughs> I don't need to bad that be king. Regarde la ba. I greet you wherever you are, either in the US, Hi. Europe, Asia, wherever. I greet you. I was having obese. I went to a hospital and they told me I have I was having obese six. So when I, they told me that I break down in tears, I said, wow, so I'm going to give bed. But I know the complication of the obese is was having irregular menstrual cycle. So last year, I was roaming about on social media. I went to Instagram, and I found one blogger page was doing commercial for him, uh, head by head. So I just took the number and wrote it down and contacted her. And this woman had a time for me. She explained everything to me. Mom, you're going to have, you're going to have, you're going to carry your baby. I said, okay. So, so I have a distributor in Ghana. Then she gave me that number. Then I contacted the guy that said, my sister, Money then, my sister made the medication to me. Then last say April, I said this medication. On May, I was pregnant. I couldn't believe it because since 2017, me and my husband have tried to conceive, but I couldn't. People was calling me names. Like sometimes I'll be in my car, in my room, like I cry like a baby. Because I was, because I lost hope that God is on my side. Because people are calling me names. Oh, you can't give birth, you are barren. Like, I become so depressed and so stressed. Like, I was frustrated. Like, I don't know the word to use. I was so depressed in life. I was so depressed. I thought, oh, I thought the world has turned it back on me. Not knowing I can give birth. When I, when I met him, I ran now. I'm a beautiful baby girl. I carry her for a whole nine months without no complication. What I say, this medication is no fit. My dear sister, my dear lady, please call him. Uh, and I won't say give a try. Have faith that when you do medication, you two are going to conceive and carry your baby in your hand. Call her right now. ASP. The medication is so it's not like other herb herbs that they will do commercial like bring this, bring this, we go to help like I try a lot of medication but none of them help me. But this one I put a smile on my face. Right now me and my husband we are a happy couple right now. So I try so I say is call him out right now and give her a try. Contact her, she will explain everything to you. Don't drink. Don't eat sugary food. Do exercise, drink more water, and drink a lot of, eat a lot of fruit. That's why I did. Right now, I have my baby. Like, I'm a happy person right now. Right now, I can, I will say, I have a beautiful baby girl. She's so cute, she's so cute. So, I'll say, call him out right now. She will help you to conceive. The medication is no fit. It's not fake. Her medication is not fake. Yes, I faith in the medication and pray over it. I know you conceive. The God who are dying for me, he will surely do it for you. Hi, my name is Eunice. I was suffering from PCOS, which is ovarian cyst. And I've done a lot of scans and I've been in a lot of hospitals. 
So I was following Ohima Fertility. Um, I think I've been with her in Instagram. It's, it's almost two years now. So I decided to give a try. So I called her when I was in the UK. I called her and I explained my situation. And she told me that she will give me medication for six months. So she posted the medication to me, as she said. And I started using the medication. So when I did three months, honestly, my, my menses, it wasn't coming. So I called her and then we both, we had a chat, a long chat. And then um, we discussed that when I come to Ghana, I will do a scan. And then, so I still continue with the medication. And what happens? What happened was that um, I visit my GP in the UK and then they told I was forcing my GP to do a surgery because I have a PCOS. So um, I have an appointment on February 2003 coming that um, I'll do the surgery of the ovarian cyst. And God be so good. I came to Ghana and then um, I was chatting with Ohima and then she told me that she will not say anything until I go for scan. So last week, I went to two hospitals in Ghana to do the scan. When I did the first one, I told the doctor that no, no, the scan wasn't right. So the doctor said to me that um, I should I should go to another hospital. So when I go to the hospital and they, they told you a different thing apart from what I've given to you, come back for your money. And you know what? Because I was having PCOS about four years, I wasn't believe what the doctor was saying at all. So I went to another hospital for the same scan and it confirms that there is no PCO, there is no ovarian cyst. And I was like, wow, this is unbelievable. And you know what happened? When I was doing Ohima's treatment, a friend of mine in the UK said, there is another medication that um, from the USA, so we should go for it. You know what happened? What God cannot do doesn't exist at all. They didn't send the medication. I sent them the money and the medication. They didn't even post the medication to me. So I was still using Ohima's fertility. And to be honest with you, today's date is, um, what's today's date? Um, I think, I think on the 3rd, today is on the 3rd of January. There is no PCO, nothing. So I was saying to myself that the scan that I took, I'm taking the scan back to the UK and show my doctor that the PCO that they said I'm gonna have the surgery there is no PCO anymore I'm here to recommend or hear my fertility to you that if you have any problem tube blockages fibers PCO ovarian cyst please go to Instagram and search on him fertility speak to her and people who are laughing at you they will bow down their head when they sees you. God bless Ohima. Be there for us and we love you. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you and goodbye. Woman, no be every problem be capo talaba tasko bun la ta do 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 do. No. There are some problem na physical. You understand? For you to become judge, you go read. For you to become lawyer, you go read. For you to become doctor, you go read. Prayer, not they make you, they be all those things. Now say, see, be to our body. There are some ethical we'll get. There are some IP we'll get. My brother, now physical. Not be everything say, oh, the devil, that the come of a carrier. You know, now one pass I, when I want to like, the way we they brought us up, the thing they affect us. We don't live physical fight. Everything about us is spiritual.
spiritual fight. Very soon now, we're not going to really cook for us again. Now, spiritual food, go to eat. So if you get problem between, you know, if they born, you get, you know, they see your period, you get gloria, you get sabinicoco, if you even be mad, you get any health issue, contact this woman now. And their number be that. Not call my inbox as I wanted one. Now the number be this contact. Share your problem. Not be every time you go meet pastor, he, he, the thing don't come. Oh, they can give you fasting, give you like this. My brother, some of, some of the things are physical. I for die because of I paid this. I paid this door boss. My brother, they come and say, Oh, not go anywhere. They say that they shop your, 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 your liver. Uh, they don't pray now. Oh, yeah, go as I for die if I not do the operation. Some of you know, they, they, they say, Go in to meet doctor now and I see native doctor. That makes some of them that they die unnecessarily because of pastor. The pastor that they dodge, they go to hospital. You did that, they do kabosh, 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 kabosh. Come on, cut out the woman now. Uh. If you get any health issue, make it help you with herbs. No time. Don't go straight to other news, okay, <laughs> For the past how many years now, I don't know what to do our Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development. I no know what this innocent bomo Ghana they call him Wele. I no know what he do now. Oh, now go call. That was two years to three years ago. Say me the band bomo is not good for the body. Bomo no good go. Bomo see day we see the shopper. Yes, they don't. I don't bust out with one new one. Say one sickness. He did the entire region of Ghana, Burkina Faso, Togo. He did. He did. He pass through bomo. And a bush meat, bush meat, bush, bush meat, and dry meat, they come. Say, we could not eat her. Oh, okay. He said, because now those things, now they cause the wild as also. So, more stop bush meat, bush, bush. I'm not going to say bush meat here. But we bush meat, you will kill me, you will you. Say, more stop bush meat. The Pama will never consider him. I'm not going to say, he had to burn some bush meat. We dry meat. <laughs> okay, then. This country eh, cannot move forward. Use dry meat, tiko, take bolo, and the rest. They say, Moku stop her. The only thing where they give us joy, because all the ones where politicians they do here, yeah, we not get joy again. In me, I'm Nigeria now, Bomo shook Bomo like this now. They say sickness, they catch people, they disturb people, they, they call the sickness one, and not even pronounce the name, and I not send me go school. I can't go do research. About the sickness, the sickness may be that too. So, those of you go to school, just pronounce them. No, many people not give me a dick as a king. I need to get a president who is supposed to pronounce them for now. You understand? Of course, you said this sickness, not this since 2011, I've been something. And this sickness, they, they enter cow. Cow, woo. <laughs> cow meat, melu. It they cash melu. It they cash goat. It they cash sheep. But Nigeria government leave all those ones. Now they come saying at Bomo. And at Bomo now every day for Bodo Yibo, they not put Bomo. They put only cow, cattle, and sheep, and goat. Nigeria Minister of Agriculture and Devel Rural Development on our corner. We think Bomo do on our talk. Those of you who watch the way they talk about the secret. Oh, yeah. Anthrax is a disease caused by Bacillus anthracis, a germ that lives in soil. Many people know about it from the 2001 by terror attacks. In the attacks, someone purposely spread anthrax through the U.S. mail. This killed 5 people and made 22 sick. Anthrax is rare. It affects animals such as cattle, sheep, and goats more often than people. People can get anthrax from contact with infected animals, wool, meat, or hides. It can cause three forms of disease in people. They are Cutaneous, which affects the skin. People with cuts or open sores can get it if they touch the bacteria. Inhalation, which affects the lungs. You can get this if you breathe in spores of the bacteria gastrointestinal, which affects the digestive system. You can get it by eating infected meat. Antibiotics often cure anthrax if it is diagnosed early. But many people don't know they have anthrax until it is too late to treat. A vaccine to prevent anthrax is available for people in the military and others at high risk.
Wa me na weti po mo abush meet do Nigeria government. Di oru ama. Eh? Everything on a go stop. Pomo. Una no jeli ko pomo. Ama wu yi pomo yo. Shuk meeti. Pomo for party. They bush meat. Use are they cook banga soup. Oh, <laughs> gonna. When they play with us, all those are where they not protest for subsidy. Just ban pomo. Oh yeah, now you go see protest. You will see. When I go run, I put a tinubu. You better warn all these your people. Maybe they give people better information. If they not know work for that, they are minister of agriculture and the rest. They are they just see something. They just can comes. Maybe they visit that they work. You know, we say we do research now. They just can say pomo, bush meat and dry meat. Now they cause the sickness. I don't know. Even your cow meat where they eat, your goat meat where they, why you know how that? If anybody touch goat, eh, dry meat and bomb for this country. I am. We can do we trust our own. See head. He got one particular song where they sing. Those of now where they go church with me. The song go like this. I am a divine project not to be abandoned. I am a divine project, not to be abandoned. I may come through my God. Oh, Parara, he took some music, King Parara. He will never abandon me until he finishes his project. Oh, in my life. That song, eh, is not for Nigeria because God, eh, don't abandon this country. <laughs> On a country, there is no project for God to be complete for this country because God already complete and all alone and it is scattered. If I don't know this man, make I introduce her to Nana. They call Senator Bukashukwa, Abina Bukashukwa, Abina Bukashanwa, Abina want him. Your knees are too hard. <laughs> they say God don't they sleep only one. Don't go confess for Senate. I don't know what he should come. He said this Senate people, I'm gonna know say my wife help some of Una. During the time when I get problem, I miss engineer my wife to help Una. What did they talk different? Where they go different? As he won't confess, La Wan, this way nobody know how he take come back to be senator. Now nah, say me they off the man, Mike. <laughs> Make him know they talk. <laughs> see, his wife. Those of now don't know this man, his wife now president of a peak court. Since, since March something something, I forget the date, but then he retired without 2020. Now the woman be. See the woman be this way. Those of you who have watched the man was ready to talk. <laughs> My wife, whose freedom and independence I encroached upon while she was in office. And she has been very tolerant and accepted my encroachment and extended her help to my colleagues. Uh, the song wish. Please, I, I don't think this is a good idea going this direction. It's not a good idea. It's not a good idea. Please. Woman, the woman where this man they talk about, so will be wife, so. Now, article say, may they remove from the judges, then we don't want to judge their case for 2019. He said because they just say they paid the woman six billion naira. So, so the woman not go judge the case where made the woman come out there so that they will do the thing. Those of you remember what you that way talk about this one. And President Muhammad Buhari has approved the appointment of Justice Monika Dongban Mensen to take over from Justice Zainab Bokachua in acting capacity. This comes as Justice Bokachua attains the mandatory retirement age of 70 years. As she also exits from the bench, Justice Bokachua reflects on her 45 years of judicial service. Glowing tributes are being showered on now retired Justice Zena Bokachua for her contributions to the development of the judiciary. Many believe her legacies will strengthen the administration of justice in Nigeria. She reached the peak of her career as the first female president of the Court of Appeal in 2012. With her exit, there will be about 84 justices left on the Court of Appeal bench. Some of her achievements include the upgrading and commissioning of several court complexes, including the Lagos Division. 
She is now canvassing for better working conditions for her former colleagues, more funding for the court, restructuring of the court system, and reduction of the huge pile of cases. In election petition matters, I think not all matters should go to the Supreme Court. Not all matters should go to the Court of Appeals. Some should end at the tribunal level. And then the politicians have a habit of, let's say, 10 parties participate on one seat. Each and every one of them would go to court. It's the same facts. Eh? It's the same law. So why waste the time of the courts? And then if they don't take, if we don't hear the cases, their complaint is that they are not given fair, hear, fair hearing. We are not that many. One controversy she finally weathered was her membership of the 2019 Presidential Election Petition Tribunal, whilst being married to a senator who is a member of the All Progressives Party. So if I were given six billion naira, you think I would still be here? Huh? Though the court ruled that the petition of the People's Democratic Party had no merit, she chose to withdraw from the tribunal. I would even forgotten that my husband was a politician. I would even forgotten that <laughs> I could have just gone. I thought being the president of the court, being the number one in that court, I would have been the best person to handle that matter. I had no doubt that I would have done justice to that matter. But once they raised that issue, they raised a doubt in my mind. A doubt is that no matter what I do, no matter what I say, it would not, they would, Nigerians would not look at it because they are always looking for a scapegoat. They will not look at it in the way I would have looked at it, that I'm a judicial officer, that I'm being impartial. Justice Bokachua is also celebrated as a great pillar for the girl child in Nigeria. Her successor, also a woman, is Justice Monica Donban Mensem, who will serve in acting capacity for three months. Well, uh, we are to fear the woman. The woman said, I will judge the case where say, but Nigeria, they say, make a call withdraw. We are to fear and we are to say, even forget say, husband and uh, politician. <laughs> okay, now. You might be forget your husband to be, you don't know your husband work. Say you don't know, say your husband a politician. Why are they turn and say this country is gone? They know they use us. Everything about this country is formalities. Before the election, I turn at that time. This thing not go work. That's oh, this generation. Oh, that's okay. Oh. This thing cannot work. Oh. That's because law not there. This guy say, oh. say they don't sign it to law. This this be way boari sign so he go affect, he go, he go, he go, he go favor us. Nah, the thing go dead transparent and say, oh. <laughs> corruption way EFCC not be stop we gone. Corruption way police not be stop we gone. Corruption way DSS not be stop. Corruption way I, I, uh, SS. Corruption way whether na ICPC one thing one thing not be stop. Now I'm going to use voters can stop. When I say I decrease that, they let me do more now. When I go do now, they don't shook up for now. When I they shout, I they laugh now. When I say, oh, you parent, you don't need the... My brother, no thing go feel work for this country because the law is not working. This man now, is just turn a simple example. Why would this court, this matter with the court, so <laughs> it's not going anywhere. They just they play with it until you know, mind go calm down. Neither they do it now. They go do it now, eh? Now, when they judge the case, like say that they go court, they do like this, or you they judge the case. Until you know now, call tire. Now, you know now, call 10 Nigeria government say, I bet we don't tire, Tinubu don't win, you don't enter, I'm just wait another for or four years. Now, so they go do now. These people, they use your mind, see, they walk you. Because Nigeria, they don't buy, uh, Kaba don't buy everywhere. For Nigeria to go, now be with this orator, uh, revolution. If you don't believe, <laughs> when I say they wait for, for court, they wait for like this, see, waiting the man talk. I wife they help a lot of senator. Lawa see wait to enter through court. Even Russia they ask us, see how you take enter all of us that buy from. This country is gone. May they find buyer, may they just sell them, everybody share, make everybody go. Because all this way that they speak English, they do your honor, your like this. These are just formalities. You never go police station where they say sign. You can say why they say it's just formality. Now so this is our country be. All these big big with all this like this. My brother, I need you I need you for time. This very message now for obedience and bats. Because 
No, na to be like Shesi and uh, uh, Mayu now for Nigeria. This one they support Peter B. This one they support Tinubu. No, na na they do on a safe now. I want just go talk now. How politicians did the fight because some of them never know. If you don't start politics, it's 1999. Come. When I will not say supporting of all these our politicians and our brain. Not go and kill yourself. Even their children not carry the thing for head. Your Peter B. Piki not carry them for head. Your Tinubu Piki not carry them for head. Your uh, Atiku Piki not carry the thing for head. But some of them not even don't get any me because of Peter B. Put Peter B. Because of that. Because of Atiku, Atiku, not to Atiku fans. The devil they give up. So, major put to little B. No, major put their three. Some of them, because of these three men, on our close friends, on our, on our turn them to enemy. So, I need the betterment of Nigeria. This one, the token here. Why go support? My brother, you are doing yourself. Because the people who are they fight for, they go turn friend tomorrow. I want you to play this clip for now. I just show now. Our politicians be. <laughs> <laughs> because you dare say, those of you who have never watched this video, <laughs> oh, yeah. regarding that. Woman, uh, and so politician be. See, uh, Benway, former Benway governor. Where is, oh, Peter B, oh, like this. Neither the city, no, so. See, many of them, neither they apologize, no. See, many of them, neither they go, so. My brother, politics, now, nah, yeah, government, something, now, nah, yeah. Retire, you remove her. Some of them, don't quarrel with my wife, or my girlfriend, or my best friend, or no one will see, or no one will not even injure ourselves because of all these people. I want your turn, I say, or not be the most stupid people. No matter how you fight your neighbor, no matter how you fight your papa, fight your mama, fight me. My brother, these politicians, all of them, they'll be friends. Yeah, she don't know they fight each other. But me and you, we never know how this one to be. We say, we need it. My brother, if, you be, if Nigeria go good, not be me and you, we go fight. All sector go work. The law go work. If law no work, all your talk there, no go work. Even if it all be see later. Nothing go work. They go use bomb. They bomb the full country. Ben. If uh, they no pussy yet, nothing go still work. They just they form say this won't work now. Nothing go still work because the law is not working. See a bad bill of NDDC. A bad bill. Maybe our senior president. So nothing will work. Whether on a talk go here. Now let me say I'm not there any side. But I just they mock people. So those of you who know, fight on ourselves between politics and like this, you are just doing yourself. <laughs> These people they day now. So we fight between Ibori. And Ogboru, these two people, only data people go to And any data stay with the support of B and uh, Tinubu are like this. You are just doing yourself. Because uh, Ibori and Udwaga don't support give you sense. So Udwaga, uh, uh, Udwaga, we, I say Udwaga, Ogboru, we will die for that time. They never have a call result of, of Obeyori. Now if they reach there, they follow the jubilate. You know people will die because of Ogboru. Say Ogboru must enter. Now that is why so. Now, Ogboru now, the PDP, well, all of us say we hate so. Ogboru first us join PDP now. So those of you know they fight. <laughs> now you go die, you. Now you, somebody go lost for your family. Nigeria go see they move forward. All these people will die for lucky. The Nigeria see they go forward now. Nothing do they. When they say God day, God day, God day, not let Africa now God day, God day. The thing not the work. All this God day, you go see what the God go do. No, show me country where God go come and say, call repair, call kid their politician. Now you must fight too. They dare fight your brother. <laughs> According to my robo people, they say, Hokbore, Nene, Hokbore, Ikejiri, Nanai, Naor, Wehimire, Patrick, Inoi, Wehwa. Nigeria is gone. Those of you now, where see the guy who say the country go good, I just they laugh for now. Nigeria don't go. Because if you repair you, they display you. If you repair you, they display you. If you repair you, they display you. Guy, they dribble us like Okusha. 
Like the way they did they do you uh, Champions League or those Premier League, the way they, they did the table and they bring the match, they do like this, they play shoulder. Now, so Nigeria politicians, they play shoulder. They are on to destroy, destroy this country. If they repair it, they will spoil it. If they spoil it, they will repair it. Now, so they just they do. No need to even talk much. Call it. <laughs> what did they talk? Play the full video, finish for them. Oh, yeah. No, I'm, I'll be king. I don't need to do regard. Regard it. Regard it. I don't need to be bad. Now. Nigerians, I will speak. Even if today is the last day I will spend in this world, I want you to know that the battle Ashwaju is fighting to rid this country of endemic corruption is a battle that cannot be left in his hand alone. Every head of parastatas in Nigeria must stand up to let him know the rot in your own establishment. I tell you, NDIC stinks. There's a lot of rot going on. They say when you fight corruption, corruption fights you. Now, the document you see in my hand is one of the ways the corruption engineers in Nigeria are fighting back. You know, each time you say you want to have a true change, like the one brought about by President Ashwad Bola Ahmed Sinumbu, you will have the change champions who will support him, but you have the change skeptics and the game change game changers who will frustrate all his effort to rid Nigeria of this mess. Now, this is the purported new act of the NDIC. And I tell you for nothing, this is a Mephiles act. I tell you because here they have taken away the powers of Mr. President in respect of the NDIC. Let me start by telling you the mandate of the NDIC. The NDIC is set up as an independent agency of government to ensure that depositors' money is protected in all the banks and all financial institutions to protect it so that Nigerians can be protected from the misbehavior of bank directors, whether in conspiracy with the CBN or when they are acting alone. That is why the NDIC has been set up as an independent body to ensure that depositors do not cry, even when banks fail. So there are four mandates. The first mandate of the NDIC is to guarantee Nigerians who have deposits in all these banks that relax, be calm, your deposit is safe. Number two is to inspect the banks, because prevention is better than cure, to go around the various banks and ensure that the, the banks are not messing around with depositors' fund to ensure that creditors are, I mean, those who are borrowing money from the banks are those who have the capacity to pay and to ensure that the bank is run in the right way to bring about the happiness and the wellness of depositors. That's our second mandate, to go to the banks and ensure that we prevent collapse. Now, the third mandate is... Whenever the central bank eventually declares that a bank has failed, the NDIC, without interference of anybody, should go there and resolve what is happening. What do you do? You begin to gather the data of depositors with the aim of ensuring that deposit depositors get the, the, the sum that is meant for them. For example, if, you, if a microfinance bank fails, for instance, we first pay them 200000 even if they, now if they have more than that, we are going to liquidate the assets of the of the banks. We are going to go after those who are run, who are you know owing the bank, and we are going to now make sure that we pay back the balance. But I tell you, that is not what is happening now. They've taken over. The cabal have taken over NDIC, and they took this particular act to the former president Buhari 48 hours to his living office. They knew at that time that the man was so busy and he would not be able to read everything they have put here. Therefore, they got him to sign it. Now, I tell you another thing. Another fraud was committed. This document that was signed is materially different from the vote and proceedings of the National Assembly that passed it. When I was appointed, I told all Nigerians, I am not celebrating. I am going to be part of those who will work with Ashiwaju to rid this country of mess. Do not congratulate me until I have left NDIC better than I met it. Therefore, no sooner that we were appointed by the president waiting for confirmation, they quickly 
introduce a new bill, a law that will truncate everything that we wanted to do. So I participated in the House, in the National Assembly because as a lawmaker, I am a lawyer of over 30 years at the bar. So I know that whatever is passed by the National Assembly and assented to by the President will be what my board will implement. So I was interested in every detail of what they were passing. My God, what has happened now is completely different from what was passed. Let me tell you, not all Nigerians are corrupt. The National Assembly still has so many senators who are men of integrity. The House of Representatives, not all of them are corrupt. There are men of integrity. They knew at that time that if they introduce this section that I'm about to talk about to them on the floor, they will vote against it. So, so many senators who are men of integrity. The House of Representatives, not all of them are corrupt. There are men of integrity. They knew at that time that if they introduce this section that I'm about to talk about to them on the floor, they will vote against it. So what did they do? It was hidden somewhere. It was not part of what was passed by the National Assembly. The National Assembly passed a board, a board that will have the representatives of the seized geopolitical zones in Nigeria to superintend over the affairs of the NDIC to ensure that the NDIC is able to discharge its duties. Now, it also gave Mr. President the free hand to appoint competent Nigerians who are capable of becoming managing directors and executive directors. You know what they have done now? They have tied the hands of Mr. President and they said only someone recommended by a Mefele alone can be the managing director or the executive director. You know, in the previous act, Mr. President has the freedom to appoint any competent Nigerian to pretend over the affairs of the NDIC. Now, when the National Assembly passed, when the, uh, I have the vote and proceedings of the Senate, the original vote and proceedings, you know, I understand that they are trying to doctor and I call this clerk of the National Assembly. Don't let them put your name in a mess. Some workers are compromising. Don't allow them. They forget that the vote and proceedings is in the hand of 109 senators. So if you doctor one, you cannot doctor all the others. The vote and proceedings is in the hands of 360 House of Representative members. Because I participated, I was there. So I have the clean copy which preserved the right of Mr. President to appoint managing director without recommendation of CBN governor, to appoint executive director without recommendation of CBN governor, to, which allows the seized geopolitical zones to be represented. You know what they have done now? They have removed the, the representatives of the seized geopolitical zones. They have now fraudulently made the permanent secretary who does not have time to be the chairman of the board. How can the permanent secretary be a judge in his own cause? That is the ministry supervising the affairs of NDIC. How can the head of that ministry also be the head of NDIC? Do you know why? I visited the permanent secretary and he told me that, Honorable Blatif, I am telling you, I told them several times, do not make the mistake of making me the chairman of the board. I have a thousand and one things to do as the permanent secretary minister of finance, I have 36 commissioners of finance waiting for me at Hilton. I have so many things to do. They know, they know that I will not have time to participate so that they can do all the mess they want to do. Secondly, do you know what they have done in this act that is annoying? They have killed the career progression of all the 1,600 workers in NDIC. How can you say that somebody who is working as a teacher should not have the hope that one day I will become the principal. So what they have done here is that no worker, no director in NDIC can ever progress to become executive director, to become the managing director, because they said, even if you work all your years in the NDIC, only the central bank can appoint and recommend who should be the executive director or managing director. NDIC is an independent body from the central bank. Central bank should be in charge of their own executive directors. They should not truncate the career 
of 1,600 Nigerians. Now there is protest among the workers. Now they have demotivated the staff. They, they have demoralized the staff. There is no way they can ever rise. I call on Mr. President never to act on this. And I tell you what is worse. Which one is affecting depositors? The one that is affecting depositors is that NDIC will no longer be able to make depositors smile. I tell you for nothing. I have thousands of petitions on my table by Nigerians who are owed by the NDIC, who find it difficult to claim their rights from the NDIC. They are frustrated. As I speak, they can come out. You know, because the NDIC has so many useless sections here. The sections that say, if you don't come and claim your right between so so time, the NDIC will become the owner of your money. It is there. How can you say a, 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 a microfinance that is closed? And I'll say, how do you now get these this depositors to come and collect their money? You say you are, you are, you are using town crier. Town crier in today Nigeria to go and tell people in the village that all of you who have money in Uganda microfinance, come and collect your money from NDIC. When they have a phone number that you can call, so you are denying Nigerians trillions of money. And I will not accept it. My board will not share Kobo. I think of my grave. I think of my Lord. I want, if I'm removed tomorrow, I don't care. But this law now has removed the independence of the NDIC. You know how now the former law says NDIC shall be free to go and investigate, to go and investigate the, uh, the, it did not affect our tenure. It's because they are not lawyers. I am a lawyer of over 30 years at the bar. When a law was done, you know, look at the previous law. We were appointed validly by Mr. President, acting under the 2006 law. We were confirmed validly. Validly by the Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, acting under the 2006 law. Okay, now, Section 98 of the new law says, Everything done under the old law shall remain valid. So what are you saying? Why are you saying my So our tenure is not threatened. The president has the right to dissolve. If it dissolves us, I go back to my house. I will ask my friends to celebrate because I say, do not congratulate me until I have left NDIC better. How do I want to leave NDIC now? I want Mr. President not to act on this law until it is probed. Probe the passage of this law. Probe the inclusion of Section 7, which takes away the right of Ministry of Finance, which takes away the representative of Ministry of Finance and replace it with two directors from Central Bank. Probe why what is passed is fundamentally different from what is assented to. Probe what happened between the time the National Assembly passed it and the House of Representatives passed it, and there was no divergence under the law. Do you know the status of this new act? It is null and void. Anytime Mr. President assents to a, to a bill that is materially different from what was passed by the Senate and the House of Rep, it means there is a material omission, and that law was not matured for assent. There is a need for the incoming the, for, for the new administration that is here by the grace of God to return this act to the National Assembly when it is proclaimed that they should investigate and allow National Assembly members to debate because I know National Assembly is made up of very reasonable people. There are senators who are men of integrity and House of Representative members. Who will now to read? They will now read whether they will voluntarily say no member should represent the six geopolitical zones in the new board. We should allow the management to be the ones doing whatever they like without anybody monitoring them. Okay, we said the national, the the the, the NDIC is supposed to be independent. Whether with the additional 35 sections they can take away that independence by putting us in the pockets of the Central Bank of Nigeria. 
this is not the NDIC I want to work with. This is not the NDIC that will guarantee payment to Nigerians. No wonder there are thousands of petitions right on my table. Do you know what they do? Among the so-called microfinance bank that they said have failed, it is a fraud. Many of these banks that have been closed are liquid, they are viable. Many of them are owned by Nigerians who wanted to assist the poor. But these people, out of their fraud, they closed them. And there are sections under the new law by which they can take over their property, by which they can transfer their deposit to their own, you know, uh, microfinance institutions. I tell you, Nigerians, let's cry out. Let's cry for this nation. Let's cry. Let's cry. We, there's corruption. There's corruption. There is vices. We must shout. We must not allow it to see the light of the day. Mr. President, don't act. Don't act on the new NDIC Act. Probe it. Go to the bottom of it. They have, they have paralyzed the Ministry of Finance. They have removed the Ministry of Finance from supervising. They have removed the power of Mr. President from appointing those whom he finds competent. And now they have subjected the deposits of Nigerians to danger. So you will find it difficult. That is why many banks that have closed several years ago, you cannot collect your money because they have very, very useless sections of the law, which is tying the hands of Nigerians from reaping the fruits. May Allah bless you. I don't bloody care about their office. I am still the NDIC chairman. I'm re I have, have resumed. I have been inaugurated. And until Mr. President dissolved that board, nobody can ask me not to act. I will act and support the current government to rid that institution of corruption. Thank you. Please help me share this. Help me share it. I don't have the power of media. I don't have the power to pay people. But I trust you as Nigerians. You will share this to ensure that all Nigerians are carried along and to know the evil that is happening. You know, this one is toying with Nigerians, poor people who pay into the banks. You will not be able to collect your money out of no fault of your own. Now, our job is to make sure you are happy. But now they want to make you sad. They want to make you frustrated, even over your money. It will not happen. May God bless Ashwajibola Ahmed Tinobu. May God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. May God bless all of you who are chain champions. Nigeria will not be the same again. It's in renewed hope, and we shall win. Thank you. Well, then, uh... What do I need to talk again? With all this, all this man talk like this, do like this, like this, do like this. My brother, nobody go go prison. Nobody go go anywhere. Nothing go still happen. The law go still go. If you don't take time, this man will go even die. Nigeria will still move forward. My brother, we are not going anywhere. Say this country, make everybody share. No time. <laughs> Our sister, where they call Idabasi. Where some people don't know we on that they see news, say they don't disqualify her because of Iran. Not be everything they talk on my side. <laughs> he don't finally break the record. For the past how many weeks now, they get the girl out attack. You can't call wrong, call me, say Parana. You know, you not call me by name like that because <laughs> they call me King. He said, King Parana. I said, what did they happen? He said, there is a problem. There is fire on the mountain, but nobody's running. I said, tell me what is wrong. He said, since we break the record for the 100 hours cooking. <laughs> Cookathon. <laughs> he said, Guinness not got the picky call again. I say for the way for where I be as a chief of the world, the king of this of this world. I say okay, not worry. Now me call Waka go the headquarters for UK because some of them not even know say this Guinness Book of Record their headquarters headquarters the UK. As I reach there, based on my personality of human confiando, <laughs> okay, when they see me, if you see me all of them today, oh, this royal highness, this royal highness. I say, everybody stand up. Here, mama. My small sister, a cook, not be small cooking. All Nigeria, everybody, Africa people, they don't congratulate this guy. Wow, I never give out this one. They say, oh, they, they process this one thing. He say, according to our sister, I say, 100 hours. But with a share because of, say, the resting and some things, then, now 93 hours, something. Say, but they fear to talk. I say, no, we will manage it. 93 point something, we will manage. Then do it. Now they, 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 they,
This morning now, the boss has say the girl that be the <laughs> older now. Not the small jubilation. The girl before they would they walk out they won't go see one of you. You are someone now now from there to the channel. Oh, what are we very happy? Oh yeah, Rega de la ba. It's official. Oh my God. Oh my God. Congrats, babe. Congratulations, Ilda. Congrats. <laughs> thank you so much, God. Thank yeah. you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. It was not even thank you, thank you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god, you are good. Oh god, you are so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Alpha and Omega. I magnify your name. I glorify your name, but there is not like you, Father. Thank you. It's conquered. Yeah. And those of you who watch away, uh, Guinness Book of Record, very fine man. White person, I they use. Could I not use black? They call tell us. I tell we now. Oh, yeah. Regarde la attempting a marathon record receives five minutes break for every hour that they complete. This is to allow suitable rest breaks for the participants due to the prolonged nature of these records. In this case, there was a miscalculation when it came to Hilda's rest breaks, meaning we are unable to award the 100 hours claimed.
Ah, you bueno. ah, You get lucky. <laughs> uh, they can't laugh where they come before. They can't just say they disqualify you. Thank God, so you do 100. Say so you not do the 100 before this hour, so they remove. That means before you start all over again. All this, my congratulations, my like this, you for pay the back. Nah, nah, she's the holder now. Nah. And about the other girl where they cook, that girl just the one for people to know. Some of them are too, they, too like a proko. The girl just won't make people know. They know they do one for Guinness Book of Records. Just they do your own thing. So that people go know. And people already they know this other girl. Nigeria are too like Wahala. Ah, I need some tea. When I don't quarry, when I don't, hey, enemy of progress. Everybody na copy and paste for this life. This dress was dress. So I, I study, uh, how do they call it? Ulua for it. Now I copy and from. You must copy for somebody. So when I leave this small girl alone, and this is the way I do now. I like don't change. Everybody don't say they want help. So Hida, <laughs> now it's time for temptation. Politicians will start work now because all of them they don't think they are out of office. Please, if any politician come, he say, hey, can you come and cook? Oh, I want to cook. I want to do one party. Oh, yeah, not girl. Oh, yeah, not do a warrior. Hey, man, I am hungry. Well, all these politicians, they did that. They don't say, yo, I can't nah, lie. You. You they don't reach room. <laughs> I have oh, his spider man. I am in your way. I can't let you know. Yo. So beware. Because they send their PA. They come. The only person where you go reply to, if you see my DM, reply fast. You know, I'm the king of mock news. I know they do the press. <laughs> they hang you. They can't hang you. Congratulations. <laughs> I day on my own, I got a receive call from Ghana. <laughs> they say, Parana, bra, 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 bra. So, I didn't, where did they happen? They saw another one that show. <laughs> they say, the reason why Ghana is not the plenty, most of the children for Ghana, they day on other country. You know, say number two, take nine some people for Ghana concert message. John C is for their own, and uh, John C. Daniel, all you want to want If we Dabasi, uh, Bona Boy, Ghana has all come with another one again. One man goes to supermarket and I dare to provoke, say enough is enough. He said, This guy, when they play for my, you say, see Rash for Duna. He said, Now his son. He said, may do me, they come back home because he don't want to talk. He said, because now his son, I Ghana, my son, I born, I say, play ball. He said, oh God, if I talk, I'm going to be sorry, lie. Oh, yeah, I got it. Rashi, now I'm telling you, I am your father, okay? This thing is going on for too long. But I keep quiet, you know? Now, you can say what you want to say about Melanie this and Melanie that. I respect Melanie very much, and I respect the husband very much, but I have to tell you the truth, because if I don't tell you the truth, in future, you, your children, your great-great-grandchildren, they will be lost. So I am doing this not because of money. Again, I repeat, not money. It's you I want, okay? I am getting very angry, but because of you, for the sake of you, and the respect I have for you, I keep my mouth shut. <laughs> That is why, but I am your father, okay? I am. You can come at any time, come to me any time you want. My hands are open, What's okay? What's your name? What's your name? He will tell you. So Say it's your that. Name. Name. Michael, boy, Marque. And whose father are you? I am Marcus Rashford, biological father. I'm saying it again, okay? Who, who is Marcus Rashford? Marcus Rashford plays for Manchester United in England. I was a prolific striker in Ghana. Okay, I am known everywhere in Ghana and everybody knows. So this is no, there's no gimmicking around here. Okay, so I am the one. I'm saying it to you. If you, if you want to challenge me, come. DNA, DNA, DNA. I don't need DNA. Listen. No, just DNA. Rashi, no, I can't, no you cannot ask me to give you DNA. You can never tell me to give you DNA. I know your mom. I have already told them already in the world that I know your mother. And your mother is English, your mother is white, and I'm black, okay? Simple. Woman, uh, where I go, the man plays, go meet us. Uh, what did they happen? The man, they would have seen, da, na, si. Da, na, si. Da, ho, ya, me, na, si. Ye, fri, sa, ho, ye, na, na, do. Ba, so, ya, me, ye, da, na, si, ho. I said, what did they happen? He said, you're the tango because you know, say, 
Rashford go see this video and he go come back home. I say, wow, <laughs> Ghanaians, are they? Ghana people, are they? Ah, wait, wait till they stop. Ghanaians, are they now? Mope are the pepper, sir. Are they? Now let Google tell you they take. Eh, uh, Idabasi, on a take. Bonaboy, on a take. Mercy Johnson, on a take. Not you, on a take. Rashford, on a lot of take. Wait till. Ah. I want you to let you know, one of our son, we see the lost day here. Please come and collect it. Because some of them don't know, say this person on our, if they give us edict for Nigeria here. We don't have you want to have a place, song for the middle one, and Ghana guy. Oh, yeah, we got it. Ghania, in my man, in Poppy, everybody in Ghana, I cannot reject this one for us. We can carry this one. And uh, all my fans, I bet tag the other people with Ghanaians go feel carry because. Since they carry even like Tinubu, I go carry anybody. Like Mohammed, I'm among my everybody. Just the target people they go carry. Since I rush for, I don't carry every tone. I only be thirty. I don't want to take a yeti. Go to the other new time. So if you like what you are wearing, I pursue with the runner. Okay, ne. He is the king of mock news. Ah, oh God. I don't know why some people with the toss are resemble a lot of worry. Abi. Now, nah, Papa bomb me. I don't know because uh, they know they know finish you. Oh, now, nah, Papa, hey, corner my mouth on one corner. Was all the king there? The person need to do this thing. You know, put uh, the lure for it. Now, nah, be this. A lot of people they say, me and you resemble. You understand? Uh -huh. So, I don't know whether my mouth will pass your papa backyard waiting for. You understand? Uh -huh. Things can enter body. I never know now. Nah. So I don't know whether now you are go drag now go do DNA. So, but you know, say now they say Papa now born us. Oh yeah, now. <laughs> ah, I'm your younger brother. Oh, all of a sudden, ah. So I don't know why everybody always say they say for you. You understand? Ah, oh, God. Ah, so, boy, if I be real kick for real life, <laughs> people go yeah, well. Oh my God, oh, I'm most of the people who are not like you. They say you go help. I'll pull on you. <laughs> so if you like what you are wearing, I'll pursue with the runner and then you know about this. Call and make it do for you as a king. I don't need to do You understand what I mean? Another one talk to do. Fuck news, one talk sense. Another one talk to do. Hey, hey, hey. I'm a parara to talk to Peter too. Peter too, to pay the battle people. Mock news, tell the people too.